Did Bella Thorne's hack just get worse? We're gonna explain everything that has happened so far and why Zendaya and Tana Mojo are standing up for her. I'm Yeska and you're watching The Daily Report. Welcome. Bella Thorne has always been very active on social media, interacting with her fans and friends on platforms like Twitter and Snapchat. But last Thursday, fans started to notice some bizarre tweets coming from her account. Once a snapshot was posted that she would drop nudes if people followed another account, fans knew Bella had been hacked. When she finally regained control over her accounts, she explained that she was hacked by a stranger who was sending her her own nude photos as well as other celebrities' photos with the threat to leak them. So Bella did what she does best and took control over the situation her own way by leaking them herself. Now, the hacker has no ammo. She tweeted out a note to her fans stating what had happened. She wrote, quote, Yesterday, as you know, my was hacked. For the last 24 hours, I have been threatened with my own nudes. I feel gross, I feel watched, I feel someone has taken something special from me that I only wanted one special person to see. He has sent me multiple nude photos of other celebs. He won't stop with me or them, he'll just keep going. I'm putting this out because it's my decision now. You don't get to take yet another thing from me. I can sleep better tonight knowing I took my power back. She ended that with the threat that the FBI would be at the hacker's house shortly because yeah, that's kind of a real crime. You can get jail time for that. But as the news made its rounds, it also became a topic of discussion on the daytime talk show, The View. Host Whoopi Goldberg has something to say about the whole situation, and it's kind of not really great. On Monday's show, Whoopi made it a point to say that if you're famous, you shouldn't take nude photos. She explained, quote, when they are hacking you, they are hacking all of your stuff. So whether it's one picture or a million pictures, once you get that picture, it goes into the cloud, which is available for any hacker who wants it. And if you don't know that, it's 2019, that is an issue. I'm sorry, your age does not. You don't get to do that you don't get to do it. This definitely hit Bella hard because how could you blame someone for something someone else did? So Bella shot back on her Instagram story with a very long video. She said, quote, Dear Whoopi, I have loved you for so long, but honestly, I'm so displeased and saddened by your response to my leak. Blaming girls for taking the photo in the first place is sick and honestly disgusting, end quote. She went on to say that she was offended on behalf of anyone who was ever taking a sexy photo, and even Jennifer Lawrence, who was a big part of that big celebrity leak that happened in 2014. She also stated that she was supposed to appear on The View soon, but now she doesn't, quote, feel like being beaten down by a bunch of older women, end quote. But even though Bella is not getting support from the ladies from The View, she has gotten a lot of support from friends coming out and showing her some love. Lucy Hale reached out via DM to tell her she's proud of her. Logan Paul said she was a badass, Dove Cameron tweeted to support young women, and Zendaya reached out as well. She texted Bella, quote, just a reminder that you are strong and courageous and beautiful inside and out. You broke my heart with that IG post. But anyway, just being a sap right now, LMAO, just letting you know you're a light and I'm super proud. Love you. And even ex-girlfriend and always best friend forever, Tina Mojo showed up to give her some love her own way on Instagram by writing a story that simply said, quote, yo, Whoopi Goldberg, slut shaming, blaming girls for bad things that happened to them and inciting fear. I love you at Bella Thorne. Whoopi, I feel so sorry for you that you have that mindset." End quote. We are glad that Bella has a really good support system right now and we wish her the best. But now we wanna know what you guys think. Do you agree with Whoopi or with Bella? Let us know in the comment section down below. And as always, thank you guys so much for subscribing to this brand new Awesomeness TV Daily Report channel. This is where me and Kelsey live now. So if you wanna get all the news, Give us a little subscribe and a thumbs up. Okay, I'm Jessica and wow, what a story. What a story.